Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Yankees versus Tigers Major League Baseball matchup on Sunday, May the 5th, 2024. If you like all the free picks we do at PickDogs, you'll love our premium picks, our best bet. Use the discount code PICK, get 15% off. We also have products meant for people who make big bets, $500, $1,000 plus per game, looking to make, uh, looking for one-on-one -on -one VIP style service. We offer these products, they're just not available under the premium picks tab at the website. So uh, you just got to text the number you see on the screen. So if you make big bets like I do, Go ahead and text that number, but let's get to it. We've got the Yankees taking on the Tigers, closing out the series here at Yankee Stadium. Nestor Cortez Jr. on the mound for the Yankees. It's Tarek Skubal on the mound for the Tigers. Pretty good matchup here. Cortez Jr. was the opening day starter for the Yankees with Cole on the sideline still and uh, was on the sideline as well on opening day. So Cortez Jr. making his eighth start of the year comes in with a 3.86 ERA, giving up 39 hits over 42 innings, 18 earned, seven free passes, 37 strikeouts, five home runs. Pretty even effort, I would say, across the board, but from a number one starter, well, you'd expect to see a little bit better ERA, and that is the whole thing. He's not really a number one starter. Cole is the number one starter on the Yankees. We look at uh, Scooble for the Tigers. Comes in with a 1.72 ERA. We know he's got good stuff. Uh, you know, he always has had good stuff. And the problem with Scooble has always been the same, is that when he misses, Boy, he always pays the price, but this year he hasn't missed a lot. He's only given up two home runs over 36 and two thirds innings. In fact, he's only given up seven runs, six walks, and has struck out 41. Of course, not surprised by that strikeout number. Scooble, like I said, has always kind of delivered in that area. It's always been that when he makes a mistake, man, he'll give up two, three home runs at a clip thing is the Tigers have not played well historically in Yankee Stadium. We saw that game on Friday night where basically they gave the game away in the uh, in the bottom of the ninth, but that is the way that it goes sometimes. And of course the Yankees, you know, in this at home in the stadium, very very tough 9 and 4 in their last 13. We look at the way that these teams hit left-handed pitching with the with the pair of lefties going today. The Yankees uh, hitting lefties at 241 considerably better than they hit right-handed pitching, which is 216, while the Tigers hit lefties at just 204. So really uh, not quite as good. We look at these at these teams, and really it has been the bullpens that have been the, the kind of the way that the staffs have, uh, you know, really carried it out. And by the way, for the Tigers, that 204 versus lefties, it's that's on the road. At, overall, they're 242 versus lefties, but on the road, 204. So take it take that for what it's worth but the thing is is that when we look at these bullpens you know the tigers bullpen on the road has been exceptional 2.25 era while the yankees bullpen 3.57 in their home games way up from the 2.37 that they have overall well the tigers bullpen has, has been better on the road this is a good game between two teams that are playing solid baseball this season I gotta say, I think Scooble puts the Tigers in position to win one to win this one. It's just a matter of if the bullpen can hold it together. I think they do. I'm gonna take the Tigers, and that's gonna be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.